Hey guys, Malkus 1974 coming back at you with another tutorial, Malkus tutorial. Today we're going to be covering Railcraft Steam Power and the new thermal expansion Liquid Duct Pipes. So we put these both together and you get a pretty epic, massive increase to your Railcraft Steam Power. So, let's take a look. Now first, my last episode I introduced these pipes. They're called Liquid Duct Pipes. They're made by the Thermal Expansion. Uh, they're in the newest version and they're for uh, Minecraft 1.4.5. 1. For you guys that are still in Feed the Beast 1.4.2, you will have to either wait until Feed the Beast finally updates to 1.4.5. We got regular pipes hooked up here. Normally how you would transfer water, anything from pipe to pipe. We'll even turn this on early. We'll give it a little head start. I'll just start pumping. Oh, oh, it's so slow. Why are you so slow, water? Ah, oh, la 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 All right, I just can't wait anymore. Oh boy, what was that? A minute later, two minute later, I don't know. Let's go to the new pipes. Again, these are called the liquid duct pipes from Thermal Expansion. Ah, we'll let you. Ah, we'll let you get right here. We'll give you one whole head start. One hole, they're the same size. One hole head start. Okay? Come on, get up there. Ah, screw it. We'll beat you anyway. Add a red add a uh, redstone torch to power this pipe up. And well, it's leaving it in the dust. This is the turtle. This is the rabbit. See my butt. Kiss it. Have a nice day. Goodbye, build craft pipes. At least you want to watch it. It's gonna win. It's even if this thing was heated up, it still couldn't even take 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 it. So now that we know that liquid can move through these pipes way faster than these pipes, I know I'm not using golden pipes, but trust me, even with golden pipes, it would still win. Uh, we're gonna go and check out steam power. Yeah. Well, if you guys haven't actually covered, you know, Railcraft steam power. Uh, Fireboxes, all that stuff. This is not a tutorial for fireboxes and how to get these running. There is a lot of good tutorials online that I am not going to copy or replace or do again to get into that. This is just about the power differences for you guys that do understand how these systems work. I basically have industrial steam engines. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven engines hooked up to this. You guys are saying, Malkuth, you're crazy. That little piece of crap can't run all those engines. You're right, it can't. But we're going to do it anyway because I am crazy that way. And what is it going to be running? It's going to be running... Oh, let me see if I got some uh, golden conductive pipes. My little quarry. You can tell I've been doing a little test here. I almost got to the bottom of the world already. Oh my god, it's the end of the world. Oh, it is getting dark out though. We don't want that. Okay. So... The difference. She's a running. Let's turn her on now. Boom. Let's see if they can actually run. Oh, they're all moving. Oh, that's good. That's good. Oh. You can tell by looking. Oh, the steam is so slow. It's so slow. Oh, they had a little bit of steam in there. Oh, these guys had a little. I've already done this test one, so they already had a little bit of steam in them. They had just a little bit. Barely filling it up. Oh, this one's crying. Oh, this one's losing. He's going down. Have a nice day. You're out. Next. He'll, he'll stop in a minute. So yeah, basically, we know that this is a crazy setup, and it just would not work in the real world. You know, this is actually an extreme case that I'm showing here. Um, our little quarry is actually still running, but... Uh, Whatever. We won't worry about it. So, let's switch this up a little bit. Take these out. And I did use golden waterproof pipes on it this time. 
Let's hook up the liquid duct pipes. Do, 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 do. Bam! Oh, it filled up already? Holy crap, somebody call my mama. Anyway, here we go. Open it up. Oh, look at that. They're all starting up. Now still, you're not going to get the power out of these because this is an extreme case. I mean, this is just a little tiny boiler. Actually expecting this thing to run anything is uh, kind of crazy. But the difference is in the pudding. This one, the one that couldn't keep up, is keeping up. So if you guys actually built a real boiler, not that little wimpy little thing, one pipe could supply quite a bit of your thing. I don't know the, the, the quite the limit on that. I'll keep that up to you. This is just to show you uh, how you can pretty much tighten your your builds now in Minecraft using this, especially when you guys in uh, Feed the Beast finally get what we want here. Um, she's still running. We still got a full head of steam everywhere. These pipes are completely freaking insane. So insane, I'm actually afraid that the mod might, the modder might actually have to nerf them. But for right now, they are working great. As you can tell, I actually have the system, the water, pumped into all these systems to make them work. And yeah, that's all done because we dug to the end of the world. Who knew the end of the world was right there? But it is, so whatever. We'll go to the next item up for bid for you industrial craft people out there that love your EUs we all know that the boiler systems can be run by steam turbines and these steam turbines each can output 50 EU when they are running at 100% output I have a liquid steam boiler running right now it's being run by it was being run by a, a biofuel but right now I have enough uh, steam in there to last quite a while but you guys know that one pipe hooked to this system is very inefficient actually even probably more inefficient than you think but outputting at 14 outputting at 6 how many EU's are we getting out of this baby That's not good. Alright, there we go. That's much better. Four, five, six, five. Oh, it's skipping. We don't like that. Oh, three, three, five, zero, five, seven, seven. It's all over the freaking place. It doesn't know what it wants because it knows it sucks. 80 U. 99 output. How much is it sucking? Eh, it's going down. It's going down. I don't know why it's not going down, but it's not going down very well. Basically, with two of these running, you'd only normally run one of these off of something like this, but just for the shows, I, I want to show how completely insane these pipes are. And you guys that know a little bit more about the steam boilers than I do, will know what you can accomplish with these babies if given the power. You know, it's kind of like the force. May the force be with you. Oh, we'll fix that later. I'll show you how to fix that. Let's connect these babes. Ah, get off me! I don't like you there. Ah, I fell off! Oh, God. You think I know how to fly with this thing by now? Alright. She's all hooked up, other than this one part right here. And we know, to get that to work, we just right click. Bam! Oh, look at that! I sound like a salesman. Gotta stop it. I don't want to be a salesman. I just want to be me. Oh, we're starting measurements already? Yeah, that's not good. We don't want that. Whoa! 21 output! 22 output! We just hooked those babies up. We already doubled our output in both of these. We're using these... The steam is flying out of there. We're putting out. Wow. It's not a whole lot, obviously. I don't have a very big boiler running. You know how big these boilers can get. 
But, what's it going to? Oh, it's going to this. Let's check this out. Oh, yeah. She's a, she's a fueling up. So, you know, if you properly built these, got them going, had a nice day with it. We're up to 25 over here. We're up to 25. That's about right. If we disconnected this, I guarantee you'd get 50 out of this. <sighs> you can, I'm, I'm in, um, the reason I'm breaking these so easy is because I'm in actually creative mode. If I wasn't in creative mode, I'd have to use the wrench to do that. But we should jump up now to 50. If we're just running one, 50. Yeah, so that's about right. This oven can do max. Actually, with the regular pipes, it can't even do 50% out of this thing because it just can't keep up. But, there we go. See how quick it was? These are my new favorite pipes. They work wonderfully. I give total props to the mod maker from Thermal Expansion that invent made these pipes. If you guys haven't checked out uh, his other, uh, if you got Thermal Expansion, if you got Feed the Beast, right now you can actually mess with um, conduits, which is a form of uh, electrical wire and gives a whole new meaning to build craft and basically having your build craft version of an MFSU so hey guys look up some tutorials on that uh, a good friend of mine grumpy gamer has a great tutorial on uh, that I call him the the energy wizard because he knows all this stuff great but he can't play this version yet so he don't have these pipes haha <laughs> grumpy me was first but anyway yeah so you guys this is Malkuth 1974 out check these pipes out as always you know just you can uh, subscribe comment tell me how much you love it how much you hate me I don't like to hate me one so bad but uh, you know you know it's what it is so thanks for watching guys hope you enjoyed it we'll see you later